Hello, my name is Helen Köster, and I'm working at the cardiovascular research group of Dr. Herold and Professor Braun Juleos at the Otto von Guericke University in Magdeburg. We are interested in the isolation and characterization of marine monocytes in order to use them for vehicles in collateral vessel growth. The following major steps are necessary for the cultivation of bone marrow-derived monocytes. First, mouse anesthesia and cervical dislocation. Second, extraction and rinsing of the femur. Third, filtering of the bone marrow. Fourth, two washing steps with medium. Fifth, cultivation of the cells on ultra-low attachment plates. Sixth, flow cytometry. In order to extract monocytes from the bone marrow, the mouse will be anesthetized by using isoflurane and euthanized by cervical dislocation. The mouse will be fixed and both lower limbs are separated with a sterile scalpel. Both femur and tibia were harvested and washed with 96% ethanol for a minimum of 90 seconds. After this, all steps must be strictly sterile to avoid contamination. Muscles or sinew will be removed from the bone. Femur and tibia are rinsed with warm PBS for several times. For harvesting the bone marrow, the proximal and distal ends of each bone are cut with a pair of fine scissors. In order to rinse the bones, we need one sterile 28G needle, one 1 ml syringe and between 10 to 15 ml of medium per bone. Afterwards, the bone marrow is...